Hey guys, it's Vanessa, and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing my final trying everything on in my entire closet. It's come to the point where I keep getting more clothes, and I have ran out of, like, hangers. What are they called? Hangers? Right? Right? And I have gone through and put out a donation pile, and I don't show that because I just feel like if I were to show it, you guys would be like, oh, but I wanted that top, and it would just not make sense. If you've been here for my first two videos, you know I sell my clothes through Mercari, and I don't care about making money. I care more about selling them and getting rid of them. In this video, I'm going to be trying on all of my tops and all of my pants, and last time I had to separate that into two different videos, so this video might be a little like longer than usual, and I'm mentally preparing for it. I literally just took a nap instead of making plans today because I knew how much this would take out of me. Yeah, my Mercari is going to be linked right here, and my Mercari is also going to be linked down below. Let's just get started on with trying on my clothes. This top, I have not yet worn. I've started to like get into tops like this lately again, so I definitely know I'm gonna wear this. This next top, I wear a lot underneath jackets and it's a good layering piece. I honestly don't know how to wear this top, but I have not worn this ever, so I'm selling this. The bralette I'm wearing is kind of see-through, so I'm gonna cover my boobs a little bit. This top is also like the black one, just in white. I never wear bodysuits, so I'm going to be selling it. Now this top, I remember I tried it on, and in the video, I remember I was like, I've never worn this top, but I think after this, I'm going to wear it. And I have that same exact feeling right now, but I just know that I'm not going to wear it. This top works really great as a swimsuit cover-up. I think I'm going to keep this. I mentioned this in my Princess Polly haul that this top somebody needs to be home to help me zip up, but nobody's home again, so nobody can help me zip this up. This top I got a few months ago, and I really like it, so I'm going to be keeping this. If you've been subscribed to my channel for a while, you know that I loved this top last summer, but I don't think it's for me anymore, which is kind of weird to say. This top is just so easy to throw on. I used to be such a big fan of this top last year but again my style has changed so much and I said this in my last video and I was like this isn't my style anymore a lot of you guys got upset with me about that because apparently that's not a good reason to get rid of something but my style has changed so much since I bought certain items I go for certain looks now and these don't fit those certain looks anymore, if that makes any sense. I'm going to be selling this top. This top I'm absolutely in love with, so I'm keeping it. This top, I feel like, is a little see-through, so once again, covering my boobs. This top I bought for one of my videos, and I don't think I'm going to ever wear it again. I'm going to be selling this too. This top, it's kind of flowy, and I don't see myself wearing it ever, so selling this too. This is a tube top that I am never wearing. Why are all my shirts see-through? I don't know. This just says enjoy your problems on it. I have never worn this, so this is also going to be for sale. I also bought this tube top for one of my videos, and I don't see myself ever wearing after that video, so this is going to be for sale. I tried this on in my last video, and I remember saying, I never wore this, but I'm going to wear this after this. Didn't wear it at all. Black tube top, only tube top. I think I'm keeping. It's just a good layering piece. If you live in California, things are gonna get really hot really fast because the weather changes. I talk really fast. I love this top so much, ugh, but I like haven't worn it in so long, but I really want to keep it because it fits better now than it used to. I'm going to be keeping this top. Also, something I realized is how much money I've spent on clothes, and I really want to like scold myself for that because we are just now getting into the tops, like the shirts with sleeves on them. It stopped recording and I got really scared because I was like, what if it hasn't been recording this entire time and I have to retry on all of my clothes? Also, I didn't put on makeup because I'm too lazy. But back to this. This top, I'm going to be getting rid of. I still wear this blue top all the time. This top, I've never worn and I just don't feel like it flatters me too much. So I'm going to be selling this. This top, once again, is a little see-through. And I'm not about that on the internet. I've never really worn this except for an Instagram picture. So going to be selling it. Also, slight promo. If you want to follow me on Instagram where I'm not covering my boobs in every single picture, it's going to be right here. If you want to follow me, stalk me, maybe comment about my outfits, maybe make fun of me a little bit. I don't know. That's where you can see a lot of my new style and how I dress. This next top kind of cuts a little bit low, but I could wear it like over other stuff, so I'm keeping this. I wore this top because I had to buy it for a video, and I've not worn it since then. I never wear this. I'm going to sell this. I love this top so much. I put it on backwards, and I 
feel stupid right now. I think it's so great for anything really with jeans or with a skirt. Definitely gonna keep this. This is one of my favorite like comfy t-shirts that I own so I'm keeping it. This top I got a really long time ago and I never wear it and I'm not gonna be keeping it. I always say that I'm going to wear this top and I never do so I'm not gonna be keeping this. Um, not trying to flash right now. This shirt is one of the most me things ever and Nicole got it for me so I'm keeping it. I've worn this top so much so I'm going to keep it. This top I remember I put it on my last video video too and I still have not touched it. This is just a plain white t-shirt. I feel like everyone needs one of those. I wear this top a lot actually. I think it's pretty flattering so I'm gonna keep it. This top I also think is super flattering. I'm going to keep it. I love this top so much. I got it actually thrifting. This top is actually my mom's. I feel like she'd be a little upset with me if I got rid of it. For the safety of my life, I'm going to keep it. This shirt just says Los Angeles. I don't ever wear it. So I'm not going to be selling this shirt. I'm actually just going to donate it. I know I said I wouldn't show pieces I was going to donate, but if I come across something and I change my mind about it, I'm just going to donate it. Same thing with this shirt. I'm also going to be donating this. I bought this shirt in the summer and I really loved it. I'm sorry, when I did this in my last video, you guys also got upset, which I don't mean to offend anyone by touching my shirt. This shirt, it reminded me of Bozzy because his album's name was Cosmic. My mouth is getting really dry from talking so much. Anyways, I got it, but I don't really like this yellow on me. I am exhausted right now. This was one of the tops that I wore last year a lot, but I don't think it's really me anymore. Here we have this exact same one, but in a plum whatever color, and I'm not going to be keeping this either. I actually wear this red top a lot. I also wear this top a lot. First ever concert, Coast Modern. Don't think I can sell this. Another long sleeve white shirt because apparently I own a lot of these. This is a long sleeve tie up shirt that I've never worn. I never wear this top. I like it, but I never wear it, so therefore I will not be keeping it. This is another bodysuit. One thing with clothes that I mentioned before is that if it has some certain memory attached to it, I don't like keeping it, which is one of the reasons why I wanted to do this closet declutter. I'm gonna be getting rid of this top. <sighs> I'm literally so over this right now. This is just a long sleeve crew neck or hoodie or whatever you want to call it. Very comfortable, very warm. Definitely keeping this. I can't figure out how to style this and I don't think I have the boobs to fill this out. So I'm going to be selling this. It is so hot right now and I'm dying. I think I might pass out. Old me thought I could really pull off a turtleneck, but real me knows that I cannot. I'm going to be selling this. Once again, silly me with the little turtlenecks. I can't pull off this look. The sleeves are really nice and cuffed. So it gives like this oversized-ish illusion but it's not for me. I never wear sweaters and I feel like I should start wearing sweaters except I kind of broke this one like right when I bought it. I don't know if you can tell. I think maybe I should fix it up and uh wear it maybe once in a while. This is also not mine. This is my dad's if you can't tell it's really big on me. Also can't sell this or else I might not live another day in my life. I'm totally joking. My parents totally wouldn't care. They'd just be like, why don't you just give it back to me? My family, I love them. Okay. <laughs> I really want yogurt right now. This top literally just sits in my closet. One thing though about it is the material's not the nicest. Anyways, <laughs> so as I was saying, the thing with this shirt is the material isn't the best, so just know that. Also, an hour and a half has passed by, so I decided to treat myself to yogurt. Okay, we're back and the yogurt is in my belly, so. Uh, also, I'm lactose intolerant, so like the dairy is kind of hurting a little bit right now. But anyways, I got this top from Paige for my birthday, and I honestly, I really like it because it's like cinched, so it's fitting. Plain gray sweatshirt, good for when I wake up and don't feel like putting on an actual outfit. This is an ugly Christmas sweater that I just need to keep. This is a really comfy, I don't even want to fix my hair anymore. This is a really comfy pink zip up. I like the quarter zips for some reason, I'm really into them. If you've been subscribed for a while, you also know that I love this zip up. Up. It's one of my favorites. This is my Thrive sweatshirt. You guys always ask where it's from. I got it from Liv Vargas's merch line and I love it so much that I literally got it in white too. This is the only other YouTuber merch I have. This is Hannah Malosh's merch. It says, you're doing fine because I was going through a very big mental breakdown stage in my life when I ordered this. Basically, I'm going to keep it. Bad memories once again. So I'm going to be selling this and it's been worn like maybe twice. This sweatshirt, I really like to layer underneath a denim jacket. This poncho, I don't think you've ever seen me wear, but I got it with my dad. So it's like a dad-daughter thing. So I was going to say daddy, but 
like that just sounds like weird to me but it's like a dad daughter thing so I got this jacket thrifted and it's so oversized I can literally wear it as a dress and that's what I do most of the time but like with shorts because I enjoy wearing pants out in public gonna be keeping it I hate myself for doing that I'm never doing that ever again in my entire life this is a North Face jacket bad memories attached to it so not keeping it this is just another one of my oversized sweatshirts that I have in my collection keeping this <laughs> this is just an oversized long beach sweatshirt that my friend Nathan gave me a long time ago you guys probably know who he is because you all fangirled about him in my what high school boys look for girls video this is one of my favorite sweatshirts ever in one of my favorite colors ever and a lot of you guys asked where I got it from I got it from Tilly's from the kid section very big oversized champion sweatshirt so obviously I'm gonna keep it but the back is super dope once again another oversized thing so I may keep this I bought this recently for a video and I actually really like it so I'm gonna be keeping this everyone needs one of these I need one of these therefore I'm keeping this one I just bought this jacket actually the other day because I am going to Chicago so I needed bigger warmer jackets movie jacket everyone needs one if you're a girl living in OC nobody's gonna shame you for having one gray poofy jacket because I wanted to be a little more original while being basic thinner but still kind of like a white fluffy jacket which makes me feel a little more classy I think I might have broken this black poofy jacket zipper but if I get it to work I'm keeping it because I need to wear this in Chicago if I don't want to freeze of hypothermia this is a pink furry jacket but it's too much for me it comes with a sick hood though so like that's definitely a plus it's pretty lengthy I'm gonna jump so you guys can see I don't even think you could see the bottom of that Ugh. It's like that long. Keep that in mind if you buy this. Time to put on dresses now. We're making progress and I couldn't be happier. I've been filming for two hours now and my brain has turned into like mashed potatoes at this point. Please look at my room right now. That is everything I'm selling. This is everything I'm keeping. I was gonna move my giant pile of clothes but I thought it'd be kind of fun to just like chill in it. Oh my god, okay, never mind. I take that back. So this is one of the dresses and it's from Princess Polly. I just hauled it and it is really good for hiding food babies. Really recommend getting this for yourself. Baby blue bodycon dress. Too lazy to zip it up in the back but I'm gonna keep it anyways so I'm also too lazy to zip this up in the back but um, I'm also keeping this tiger print dress really love this got it from Princess Polly I got this romper in Taiwan but I, I wore it a lot there haven't really worn it since I've been back which was about maybe like 10 months ago gonna be selling this this romper is a pain to get on and every single time I pee it's like a pain but I still love it Nicole gave it to me cannot figure out how to get this dress on I don't know why my brain cells maybe just like have totally turned into mashed potatoes at this point. So, I'm gonna be selling this. Can't even put it on, how am I supposed to wear it? Just some really good denim jeans. Did I say jeans? I meant shorts. This skirt I really love, but it's gotten a little bit loose on me and it looks kind of awkward with a belt. This is a skirt from Urban that everyone says makes me look like a cheerleader, but I kind of really like it. These are just some really good shorts to wear underneath big oversized things when people ask, oh, are you wearing pants? And you're like, yeah, of course. These are the pants that I would wear underneath. <laughs> this is hands down one of my favorite things I own in my entire closet, so I ha don't have it in me to give it away. This is just a really nice denim skirt from Paxa with like a little twist on the side so I might keep it because it's like basic but a little different and that kind of sums me up as a person. This skirt I bought it maybe like three four months ago and I've never worn it. Paige got me this skirt for Christmas. It's one of my favorite skirts actually. These are one of the only pairs of shorts that I have worn continuously for a set amount of time. This skirt Love it. But of all the other skirts I own, I don't think I'm going to pick this to wear. This skirt is my only black skirt, and that's the reason I kept it last time, but I don't ever wear it. I claimed that I would wear these shorts last time after I said that I was going to sell them, and then I changed my mind, and I haven't worn them ever since then. One of the only pairs of shorts that I also like, so keeping these. This denim skirt I bought for one of my videos, but I don't think I would actually wear it again. These shorts are the most comfy things ever. I wear them when I go to bed. I'm gonna have to keep these. These shorts are really big, but if you wear them with a belt, they're really comfy. Finally done with the shorts. Time to move on to the last section. I'm literally losing my brain cells. I've been filming this video for so long. Nicole got me these pants. Most of the pants I own are sweatpants because they're the most comfortable things ever. Like, what's the point of wearing jeans when you can wear sweatpants that look just as cute? These are just some really good solid go-to gray sweatpants. I have these pants and I don't think they flatter me that much. Some really fun plaid pants. It's just like a little funky and a little different. And Nicole also gave me these, so gotta keep these. Some red pants. People ask me all the time if these are pajama pants. No. 
They're not. I have the exact same ones in yellow, but I never wear the yellow ones because I just like the red ones better. So I'm going to be selling these yellow ones. These are some Nike snap sweat pants that literally don't fit me. Uh, selling these. One thing about me is I'm not a fan of low rise jeans and the way that they look on me because I have really short legs. So it doesn't look too flattering on me, but I'm selling these jeans. Three more pairs of pants to try on. Okay. So these are just my green plaid brandy pants. You probably know someone who owns these, but they're really comfy, so I'm keeping these. These are just some sick high-waisted Ivy Park leggings, and the tag is in my pants. They're just fun leggings to work out in. I've literally never been so excited to put on a pair of pants in my entire life. This is the last thing we're trying on, and I could cry right now. These pants, Nicole and I had a plan of ripping them up, but it never happened, but it's going to happen, so I'm gonna keep these to rip them up. I'm literally out of breath. I'm so tired. I need to take another nap after this video. Here is is the aftermath of everything. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and to be honest this probably is not gonna be the last of these it's just gonna be the last one for a very long time until I basically have an entire new wardrobe again. If you haven't checked them out already I made two previous one of these. One of them was on my tops, one of them was on my bottoms and you guys really enjoyed that so if this is your first video I'm glad you stuck until the end if that makes sense also i'm squatting and i'm going into the splits right now yeah so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did make sure you give it a like and if you really like me don't forget to subscribe comment anything you want down below and i'll see you guys next time bye broskies <laughs>